I was on tour in Germany in 1986, and I met, I went to a, a, a store, a music store, and on the floor on a stand like this was a all wood thumb. And I had never seen the teardrop shape before and the, and the all wood, you know, it was beautiful, natural. And I, I really did uh, have a kind of uh, exciting moment. I like, I, which I don't usually have with guitars. They all, at that time, they all sort of looked similar. You could distinguish brands and stuff, but this was a unique looking guitar. And uh, the store owner was happy that I was checking it out and he called Woody Valen, who's a, who was one of the first now kind of iconic uh, A&R guys at Warwick. And he came to a show and brought me one. And that bass, this is true, is still my favorite bass, that first bass. I still play it, I've played it most of, uh, most of the time since then. I played in, in uh, I was playing jazz rock, and it has to be, it has to cut, you know, so it was good for that. It was, it was not the sort of visceral type heavy rock where you just want to be a, a mass with the drums, and I like that too. But what we were doing was melodic and, and arpeggios, and, and there were lots of, it was gong, there were lots of tune percussion. I was playing with Mike Oldfield then. So each thing had its part to play in a kind of a counterpuntal way, you know, was, there was lots of parts integrating. And those basses were the cleanest and clearest kind of bass I had ever played at the time.